Okay, so this is a video tour of a beautiful four bedroom villa in the Al El Madrinal neighborhood. So you can see it has very nice colonial architecture. This is the entrance to the garage, which we will see from the inside. And entering the property, you can see we have wraparound terraces surrounding the whole property. So the entrance, the main entrance to the property is here at the side. But of course many guests will obviously want to come straight through to the main feature of this villa which is the fantastic heated swimming pool gardens and views across to the neighbouring island of La Gomera. As you can see there is plenty of covered terrace space for when the sun is out uh, with a chill out zone. Uh, a fantastic dining area, enough space for you, your family and your friends. And how about this for an outdoor kitchen and barbecue. So again, plenty of shade here while you're busy cooking. So let's enter the property now through the, one of the back doors. There's plenty of natural light in this lounge. So whether you're chilling out watching the TV, indoors and again we have another fabulous dining area uh, indoors or making uh, opening the doors and combining both spaces for the times when you're entertaining so this is downstairs it's really a pure entertainment zone at the back of the house with the views here we can see the uh, front door from the other side and uh, leading through of course to the independent kitchen So as you can see, the arched window theme continues throughout the house. And we have a very good sized independent kitchen from which to host guests. Now the distribution of this house with the bedrooms is very good. Uh, here on the ground floor, we have uh, one double bedroom for those uh, who aren't looking to use uh, steps with uh, window, air conditioning, and as with all the rooms, fitted wardrobes. And this is of course next to the downstairs bathroom, which we have here, complete with a walk-in shower. So that's the downstairs of the property. Uh, very good proportions, very well laid out. What we'll do next is head upstairs. As you can see, there's plenty of natural light on the stairs. Downstairs, we have another uh, double bedroom. And upstairs, the master suite and bedroom at the back of the house. So it's a, a perfect layout for separating all of the sleeping spaces. Tilt the camera upwards, you can see we have very high ceilings, more natural light. So we arrive at this landing, master bedroom on the right, and a second bedroom on the left. So we'll start with the master bedroom. As you can see when you want, there's plenty of natural light.
plenty of fitted wardrobes and a huge master bathroom. Again, complete with walk-in shower unit. Okay, open these blinds. Uh, perhaps this is the bathtub with one of the best views in Tenerife. Which can also be enjoyed from the outdoor. If I raise the camera, you'll see a covered terrace area in the center, which is a very good sized terrace. So that's the master bedroom and bathroom uh, suite there, with all of these windows taking up the whole front of this property, which is really quite a, a, a private terrace with fantastic views all the way over to, to La Gomera. So what we'll do now is we will go through to the back of the property where we have another bedroom. Again, it's a double bedroom, currently laid out as a twin, with an ensuite bathroom. So, if we go through here, you can see the bathroom. Again, with a walk-in shower high ceilings throughout. And you also find another very large private terrace from this bedroom. Uh, this one wraps around the whole of the front of the house. I'll show you the size of this terrace. Yeah, I'm a professional photographer. <laughs> With uh, sea views and behind me all the way up to Rocca del Conde towards the peak of Teide. So we have just one area of the house left to explore and that's all the way down in the basement which is where we'll head next. So there's some very clever windows here at ground level to let the light in. And a very nice wide staircase. So of course we'll start in the obligatory cinema room. Which has recently been refurbished. It's very quiet down here. And off of the cinema room, we have two rooms. Firstly, we have a storeroom, which I don't have the key for, but uh, take it from me. Is a very large storeroom there, uh, the same width as this room, going back uh, probably two or three meters in width. And over here, this is the direct access to the garage, which we saw from the outside. But again, unfortunately, I don't have a key for it, it appears. Uh, there's room for one car in this garage with a bit of extra room as well for some storage. We come through here. Now we have next to the stairs a uh, locked storeroom. We have a laundry room, again with uh, storage for the laundry when this property is rented out and a further suite. So again, we have a double bedroom here. Again with natural light. 
And behind this room, over here, we have the ensuite bathroom. Again, natural light and airflow into this room uh, via the window that you can see. Um, high ceilings um, and everything brand new in this suite. Of course, as well, it's a very hot climate here, we have air conditioning in this room as well. So that's the video tour for this property. If you're interested, please contact the person who sent you the link to this video for more information and of course, viewings. So I'll leave you with the view here we have from the ground floor terrace, which, which view you can't really escape from from much of the house.